Hey there, NCAPers. Today we're going to talk about how to arrive at zero problems when it comes to commercial glue down carpet. Today we're going to talk about solving problems. Let me step back to the beginning. In my commercial carpet cleaning business, now we're back in the early mid 80s, I'm doing a lot of commercial carpet cleaning and what we consistently ran into was no matter what method we tried, we'd get a consistent amount of problems in the, in the form of wicking, recurring spills, and traffic lanes that were dinging out, just kind of dingy looking, grayed out traffic lanes. And so what I would do now, back in the 80s and into the 90s, I would go to my supplier, I would go to my IAC or C instructor, I would ask for advice, and, and they would give me the best advice they had, they'd say, try this machine, try this chemical, try this, try that. I tried a RX-20, I tried a higher PSI extraction system, we tried low moisture methods with bonnets, we used a brush bonnet, we used various methods combined like rotary and extraction, we tried a Von Schroeder machine, we tried host, we tried a lot of different things. And, and some things had advantages where others, you know, failed. but. All in all, they, they just weren't the game changer. They didn't fix the problem. Finally, we arrived at the Chemstractor machine. Now, those of you who've been around the industry for a long time, you remember the Chemstractor. It was a rotary machine, had a vacuum ring around the, the uh, base of the machine, and it would suck the foam from the shampoo into a vacuum tank. Worked pretty well. It was a low moisture method. And honestly, that was a big improvement over methods we had tried prior. I really thought I was onto something with the Chemstractor. And then eventually, what I decided to do was get a Cymex machine because I knew about the Cymex, a planetary scrubber, been around since the 30s. And it was kind of a, a famed machine in the industry. So I, I, what I was going to do is going to take a Cymex machine and I was going to build a Chemstractor. I was going to actually put a vacuum ring on it, get it out to a vacuum, and and basically build a super chemstractor on a Cymex platform. But about the same time I started to discover these new uh, crystallizing detergents and I began to put that together, uh, the Cymex with, with that technology and all of a sudden we stopped having the problems. We were able to fix the problems. So why are we seeing the better results? Well, with encapsulation using a product that truly crystallizes that holds the soil in suspension, we're able to stop the wicking, stop the recurring spills, stop those dingy traffic lanes, get all of the common problems, all the things that cause pain on commercial carpet, we're able to solve every last one of them very simply. Well, how's that possible? Well, keep in mind, that polymer holds the soil in suspension, it's not going to track soil, and it's also going to resist wicking, it's going to resist recurring spills. So these things kind of fit together as we develop the Release It product to give us something that would help carpet cleaners be successful 100% of the time on commercial carpet. Why this was important for me in my business, cleaning commercial carpets, which we did a ton of back in the day, was that we were sending technicians out. And the worst thing that I felt as a business owner was to get a call from one of my employees at 10 o'clock at night, hey, I'm out here on a job, it looks terrible, it's not working, we've got some areas that are just not responding, what can I do? And I'll sit there and say, well, let's see, we've got bonnets on the truck, we've got this, we've got that. Okay, let's try to step through and we'll come up with a solution together over the phone. That's no way to run a business. We need turnkey systems. That's how successful business runs, with a system that produces consistent results every time. And that's what we arrived at when we got to a good encapsulation program using Release It. The Cymex machine certainly helped with its excellent agitation. But it was on really the, the foundation of that crystallizing polymer that we have with Release It that, that just holds that soil and prevents wicking and recurring spill stains, plus the fact that it's a low moisture method. So we're not going to uh, get down into the problem areas that might be down at the backing of the carpet. Keep in mind, commercial glue down carpet has a lot of place for soil to, to hide underneath those densely packed uh, fiber under the pile. Uh, you know, the soil gets down there, uh, spills get down there, dry soil gets in there, deeply embedded. It's hard to get it out. Hot water extraction isn't going to pull it out. So it's a problem. It's a problem as we deal with uh, commercial glue down carpet. Encapsulation solved all of those problems in our cleaning business and now we're helping others and we hear from people all the time that it changed their business when they put together using the Release It product line for their commercial 
carpets. So hopefully it's made a difference in your business as well. Like I say, we're here to help you max your end cap and we really feel that Release It's done a great job of that for, for countless people, cleaning millions and millions of square feet of carpet. Hopefully you found that to be the case too. Uh, share your comments please in the comment section below how you're using encapsulation to solve problems and uh, also hit the like and subscribe when, when you're there too. We appreciate it when you do that. Thanks for watching this episode of NCAP TV. Hope you have a great day.